So, um, what are we gonna do tonight, O.C.? Well, the same thing we try to do every night, but to take over the world. Uh, I mean, YouTube. Take over YouTube. Now, before we begin, let us have a moment's silence in honor of Chadwick Boseman, the actor who portrayed Black Panther in the Marvel films. And sadly, passed away last year. Uh, what was that? Um, sorry. Well, that's fucked that up, hasn't it? Let's move quickly on. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Obsessive Compulsive Gaming. I am the Obsessive Compulsive Gamer, Joined once again by my faithful manservant slash Bucktotem Bertram. Say hello, Bertram. Hello, Bertram. And this is my review for War for Wakanda. So, my friends, War for Wakanda released a few days ago and is the third story expansion. Uh, add-on thing for Marvel's Avengers. Um, Wakanda? Isn't that the brothel you like, OCG? No, Bertram, that's Wankanda. Wank Anda. Oh. Yes, they do a very nice two-for-one special there. And an all-you-can-eat buffet on a Sunday afternoon. Yes. <clears throat> so, gameplay. Now, this expansion is very different to the others. Though, it does share the same great gameplay. And Black Panther himself plays like a treat. Um, what treat? Oh, never mind that, Bertram. Um, ice cream? No. Uh, strawberry laces? No. Uh, chocolate? It's a figure of speech, Bertram. Oh. Chocolate, indeed. Oh, now you made me forget what I was talking about, Bertram. Uh, oh, yes. Now, not only does Black Panther play like a treat, but this expansion takes place in an entirely new location. And there is also two new villains, Crossbones and Claw, who are, um, up to something in Wankanda. I mean, Wakanda. God damn it, Bertram, why did you make me think of my favorite brothel? Um, sorry. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in to my little video. You have no idea how humbled I truly feel to have you here with me. One of my loyal fans, well, <laughs> not yet that is. Not until you hit that bloody like subscribe bell button thingy. Go on, do it. Yes? I'll wait. Hit the button. That's right. Yes, yes. At the bottom of the screen, you see the little icon that looks like yours truly. Just uh, click upon that and you'll be subscribed to my madness. Then you can stay up to date with all my latest videos because after all, dear viewer, I do happen to put content out on a pretty regular basis. I think I put out more content in a day than I use the bathroom. So yes, well done you again for watching my video. You are very welcome. Now back to the review. Now, there is also puzzles in this expansion. Actual puzzles that you have to solve. Now since I have an IQ of 28, I, of course, found these puzzles to be a walk in the park. Um, what park? Oh, never mind that, Bertram. Um, Hyde Park? No, 
Central Park? No. A swing park? It's a figure of speech, Bertram. Oh. High Park indeed. Now you made me forget what I was talking about. Um, actually, an IQ of 28 is not very good. You're practically a halfwit. What are you talking about, you biscuit? The lower your IQ, the more intelligent you are. No, the higher your IQ, the more intelligent you are. For example, my IQ is 144. I don't believe you. I'm consulting Google. Uh, let's sit down. What the fuck? I told you. <clears throat> so, I'm going to try and not spoil too much for you, dear viewer. But let me just say that the final boss fight in this expansion against Claw and Crossbones is like something out of a superhero mo- Oh, never mind. Now this is a great expansion to an already great game. And best of all, it's completely free. So, there's no excuse for you not to play it. Therefore, I'm going to score War for Wakanda. An eight out of ten. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. My review for Marvel's Avengers, The War for Wakanda. If you've enjoyed this little review of mine, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't enjoyed it, well then, feel free to give me a thumbs down. Don't forget to hit that bloody like, subscribe, bell button thingy. Feel free to share this video with everyone you know. But remember the single most important thing I always tell you, dear viewer, and that is to always stay obsessed with gaming. Say goodbye, Bertram. Goodbye, Bertram! Are you still here? Go away! I'm sure you've got something better to do with your time. No, seriously. Piss off! Be gone! Au revoir! A vide Bye! What in the hell is wrong with you? Go away! Vacate this space! Hit the cross at the top of the screen! The video is done! It's over! It's finito! It's caputo!